I love Tony Hawk so much, and I absolutely lost it today when Jeff Keighley announced his first video presentation of the summer, and it was freaking Tony Hawk's Pro Skater Remastered. It's a collector's edition that includes Tony Hawk 1 and 2. I spent pretty much my entire high school gaming career playing Tony Hawk with my then best friend at the time, Bruno Mariano. We would take our PlayStations and our save memory cards and everything to each other's houses. We went through so many controllers playing this game. This is the first time I ever broke a controller playing this game, slamming it on the ground. I was so mad. I always played as Tony Hawk. I always stuck to all the vert pipes or you know the ramps doing all the tricks in the air. He always played as Chad Muska and he did all the grinding stuff. Now as time's gone on, I think I'd probably do more what he did, but at the time it was always this epic showdown of who would win in the two minute um, point battle. It was insanely fun. Tony Hawk will always have a special place in my heart as well because of the soundtrack and I love all the songs in that. I think it really did shape a lot of my music choices that I still listen to today. I still listen to Goldfinger today. There's a lot of music on there that I absolutely love. So I was blown away when I heard that we were getting a Tony Hawk game, but then I was even more blown away when I heard that it was actually going to include a collector's edition, which was actually very interesting to me. So you could pick this up right now on most of your, you know, your, your Best Buy, GameStop, Amazon, whatever. Some places it's still not in stock yet. It doesn't mean it's sold out. But as I always say, if you want it, pre-order it. And the Collector Edition is going to run you $100 US, which isn't a bad price, although you're not getting a whole heck of a lot. You're going to get the, the game, which the uh, includes the deluxe digital content, which... Um, I've seen bits and pieces of what that includes. It's probably going to be, it's a $10 price point. I'll just put it that way. It's $10 from the regular price of the game. Um, and if you want to get that, you can, um, it's going to give you a little more stuff. And the only other thing you're going to get in this collector's edition is the uh, Birdhouse Falcon 2 design skateboard, which it says it is a full sized skateboard deck. Now that doesn't include, um, any of the wheels, you know, the trucks or the uh, the actual wheels themselves. This is just the actual board. I think it looks awesome. I actually had a birdhouse um, almost identical to this shirt. I know that's a very famous icon of the bird there. Um, I had that shirt growing up as a kid, and I wore I wore it way too much, more than I wear this. <laughs> okay, and I love my Banna shirt. Um, it, it, it's just a regular skateboard. I think it's cool. I mean, in terms of a collector edition for a skateboarding game, I don't know what you would expect. Would you expect a statue of Tony Hawk? Would you expect a little replica skateboard? I mean, this is a full-blown thing. Obviously, you'd have to get the mounting gear to put wheels on it. Most of us, myself included, I don't know how to skate. But it's cool. It's kind of hard to tell, unfortunately, because the photo here blocks um, kind of, you know, the, the little collection of the uh, the box kind of blocks a little bit of it. But it very clearly says Tony Hawk's Pro Skater on it. It's got a picture of the bird and it looks like Tony Hawk's signature across the top. I think it's cool. I mean, for 40 bucks, considering you're buying the game that comes with all this bonus content, and they're going to throw in this thing. I don't know what a skateboard costs. Maybe that's insanely overpriced, but I'll bite. Um, I'll hang it on the wall. I'll figure out a way to mount it and show it off. I mean, Tony Hawk's video today, if you saw him when he was in the live stream with Jeff Keighley, he had probably 30 skateboards behind him, so it can't be impossible. Um, I like it. I think it's really cool. So if you're interested, um, right now, this is the Amazon site. It is not listed. Um, do I think? I think they've listed it on GameStop already. Let's go ahead and look. Um, yeah, the standard edition is 39, the collectors is 99. And then if you don't want this, I don't think they have the digital deluxe here. The, the other one is $10. So it'd be $50 for the game. And then I was wrong, $50 for the deck, but you know what? Let's do it, right? Let's get this thing. Let's figure out a way to hang it on the wall. Um, if nothing else for nostalgia's sake, if nothing else, because Tony Hawk 
shaped so much of my gaming years. If I wasn't playing Final Fantasy VII, I was most likely playing Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. So leave a comment below. Let me know your thoughts on this collector's edition. Is it cool? Is it dumb? What would you have rather seen? Did it even need a collector's edition? I'd love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourselves. And until next time, I will see you guys on the other side.